graphic extras. In this video, I'm just going to show you another feature of Photoshop CC 2014, new change. Uh, a very subtle one, uh, maybe in some ways too subtle, because must admit you just very, very hard to see actually. So just going to go over to the brush tool and bring up the brush pad here. So you can see all the different brushes. These are all Panda brushes from a graphic extras. And I'm going to select one and just going to apply it. Now, if I go over and I say I change change something, so I'm just going to change that subtly, just 169 bits more, you'll notice that this suddenly gets a little very, very, very faint orange. Now, if you've got, to, as I have, got the light again, <laughs> again on the screen, you can hardly see it, but it would be nice if it was slightly thick, you know, thicker than that, maybe two or three pixels at least. But anyway, so it's very thin. So also, if you just go over to Window Brushes over here and do various changes, and I think that's maybe quite a useful option. So you can sort of maybe make a new preset. So you do some changes, go over here, and you'll notice that you can actually go here and go new brush preset. So you, you can see there's been some changes, and you can quickly save it. So say a new brush preset, obviously size 71, and that will appear down there. And it's got all the changes, obviously. So I just go back there, and then go back, and you see the changes. So that's possibly the reason why I've done that. I don't know, but uh, certainly it's a nice little uh, thing. Normally, of course, if you while when you actually select the brush, you actually see this nice thin, thin blue line. Very useful feature. Anyway, I hope you found this uh, quick uh, tutorial of that very subtle change in Photoshop CC 2014 of interest. Thank you very much.